Hey everyone! So this error mostly pops up when you're logging into your account, causing failed login attempts or issues connecting with the Riot client server. Sometimes it's due to server maintenance, which leads to this problem. On the other hand, if Valorant is working for your friend but not for you, it's likely an issue on your end. It could be a corrupted Riot client, a buggy Riot Vanguard, or a DNS or IP glitch. Also, if you've recently used any kind of VPN, it might cause conflicts with your network settings. Sometimes simply restarting your PC can resolve the issue. But if the problem persists, follow these methods step by step to tackle the root causes. First, clear IP and DNS settings and renew them. This is a highly effective method for resolving these kinds of issues. Here's what we're going to do. Open up command prompt by clicking on the Windows icon then right-click on it and select Run as Administrator. Once you've launched the command prompt, type the following commands one by one. Before applying these commands, restart your router once. Then apply these commands one by one. First command, ipconfig slash release. Second command, ipconfig slash renew. Third, ipconfig slash flush dns. Fourth, ipconfig slash renew. Once all commands are executed perfectly, restart your PC and test out Valorant. This should resolve the issue. If this method fails, make sure there are no proxy and VPN settings left behind. So what happens is that most of the time when we use Windows built-in VPN settings or tools like Cloudflare Warp, after closing them, they still conflict or their configurations continue to interfere with internet settings, causing this issue. To avoid this, we'll verify our settings. First, go into the settings by pressing Windows plus I keys, then navigate to Network and Internet. Under the Connected Network Properties, under IP settings, make sure IP assignment is set to Automatic DHCP. This ensures that there are no Cloudflare warp or other DNS settings left behind. Another thing we need to check is Windows built-in VPN dial-up. Click on the Windows icon, search for Internet Options, and open it. Go into the Connections tab. Now here, make sure there are no dial-up and virtual private network settings existing. If there are, select them and click on Remove. Once that's done, click on Local Area Network LAN Settings. Inside the LAN Settings, choose Automatically Detect Settings and uncheck other options. Click OK, then hit Apply and OK. This should resolve the issue. Now once again, restart your PC so everything can take effect properly. Then try to launch Valorant. This should resolve the issue. If the issue still persists, reset your network settings. In this step, our network will forcibly revert to its default settings, which will reset everything. But remember, if you're using Wi-Fi, this method will delete any saved Wi-Fi passwords. Press Windows plus I to open the Windows settings, then go to Network and Internet. Scroll down a bit and you will find Network Reset. Click on it. Once you click on it, it will redirect you to the Network Reset page where you can read the effects. Click on Reset Now. A pop-up will appear. Click on Yes. After resetting, a notice will display that your PC will restart in 5 minutes or so. Click OK and restart your PC yourself. Hopefully, this will resolve the issue. Lastly, sometimes the issue occurs on the back end, such as on the ISP side. In this case, try using a VPN and then relaunch your Riot client. Log into your account using your credentials. Once you're in the game, disconnect the VPN and see if the issue is resolved and you can still play the game without the VPN. These methods are useful, and Error59 is a common one that I mostly face. Using these methods works for me every time. I hope you liked this video. If this video helps you, hit the subscribe button and share it with friends. Don't forget to drop your feedback. I will see you in the next video. Till then, take care. Bye.